exciting plans! Hello, this is Mermaid Liv, a professional mermaid and content creator, and today I have a big announcement. I will be rebranding myself, not just as Mermaid Liv, but as Mermaid Liv, the van life mermaid. Don't know why you say goodbye, I say hello. That's right, I am starting a new journey, traveling in a van, heading south so I can get out of this cold, be by the ocean, do mermaid things. And I'm picking up my van today, so this is the first of many vlogs. Starting in February, I will be doing a several month road trip. So my van life journey began in around August of 2021. I don't even remember how the idea came to me. It just suddenly, it was all I could think about and I knew I had to do it. I, I had this idea that I wanted to go traveling in a van and I, I hate winter and I get seasonal depression and I was already thinking about how it was going to be getting cold and I knew I wanted to get away from the cold and that's when I decided to start looking for a van. Once this idea sparked in my head, a fire was ignited and I knew I had to do it. That's how I am. I get these big ideas and I'm like, I have to do that or else. So I've been planning and saving up for this trip and it's been kind of an emotional journey full of ups and downs and excitement. You guys, I think I found the one. <laughs> so after looking at a couple of vans being disappointed and seeing how expensive all the vans are right now, because I guess everyone wants to do this van life and it's pretty trendy. The market is not good right now for buying vehicles. I didn't know how I was going to manage it. I was going to be draining my bank account to get a van. And then there's all kinds of other expenses that come with living the van life. And then I thought to myself, you know what, it would be cool if I could like trade with someone. You know, my car is pretty good. I was gonna sell my car after I bought a van. I was hoping that would give me back the money that I spent on the van. But here's how a van just landed in my lap and I didn't have to spend a cent. So I had a Christmas miracle. The day after Christmas, I was talking to my dad about my van plan. And then I found out about a conversation that happened between him and my sister, who is older than me, has 13 kids, that's right, 13 kids, and they have a van. And I didn't even think about that. But her husband, who is the primary one driving the van, he uses it just to get to work, he offered to trade cars with me. I have a Honda Civic and it works great. And so when my dad told me this, I was like, no, no way. But my sister was not on board right away because, you know, someone had given them that car and she felt a little bad about just like giving it away. But we talked about it and we decided for a temporary trade of vehicles. I'm gonna go on my trip and the plan is to switch back. I'm kinda hoping maybe I'll end up getting to keep the van. We'll see what happens. But that was exciting news and now I have the van. I'm, well, I mean, I'm picking it up today. There it is. This is gonna be my home on wheels. So I just got to drive it for the first time last week and that was a very exciting day. Here's some footage of that. First time driving in the van. This is a very exciting day for me. I was a little nervous that it was going to feel awkward driving in, you know, getting used to a new car, the pedals, you know, a lot bigger than my other car. I'm feeling perfectly comfortable and I think I'm ready to take this baby on the road. I still haven't figured out how to turn off the windshield wiper, which is being annoying and making loud squeaky noises every time it goes off, but I'll figure that out eventually. This feels good. I love the seat. It's, a, it's very comfortable, nice and upright. So it's good for good for my posture. I'm so ready to skip out of town and avoid winter coldness. It's a very cold and yucky day today. And my seasonal depression is not having it. So anyway, I'm just lost in this little neighborhood driving around in circles. But it's okay. I'm having fun. And everything is going to plan. As mentioned before, I don't like the cold and I want to head south so I can, you know, 
know, I want to go to Florida. I'm going to stop in South Carolina, Virginia, visit some people along the way. I'm going to keep doing mermaidy content. It's not just going to be van content now. So now I'm going to be Mermaid Live, the van life mermaid. I'll be taking mermaid pictures with the van and doing mermaid content in the van. Hopefully I'll visit lots of beautiful locations, nature-y spots, natural bodies of water. I'm gonna go to the beach a lot. I'm gonna... I don't even care if it's gonna be cold on some of my beach trips. I'm gonna be stopping at beaches all along the way, even before I get to the warmer weather, because I just need the beach. I am... I am a mermaid in inside, you know? I. The ocean is like my home. I need to be there. So I'm really excited to do all that and be making lots of van life content on how to live in a van, what you need to live in a van, how much it costs to live in a van, doing some general vlog videos to show you what it's like and hopefully inspire you to, to go after whatever your dream is because you know, I believe if you have a dream and you believe in that dream and you go for it, you can accomplish that dream. And I want to inspire others to live their best life and you know, live a life that makes you happy. You know, don't just go with the status quo. So for now, I've been preparing for my journey and buying the things that I need. I'll make a video on how to prepare for a van trip and I'll, I'll, be, I mean, I'll be making a lot of videos. I'm, I'm really excited. I'm feeling the passion for content creation. I know I've said that before and then I fall off the bandwagon and get distracted and <sighs> ADHD. And life gets busy and sometimes it's hard to focus on my mermaid content, but I do my best. So that's all for this video. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope you'll subscribe to this channel so you can follow my adventures. I'll be recording the process of converting my minivan into a camper van. It's gonna be decorated all mermaidy and oceany and stuff, so I'm so excited to show everyone that. I hope you enjoyed this video. I'll see you in my next one. Bye bye!